Welcome back, everybody, to another All Things Nerd video. As always, my name is Nathan. Welcome back to the Runes of Lordaeron, the battle for Azeroth scenario. I am very, very grateful. I want to say thank you to everybody who loved the first video. That video completely blew up. And uh, for me, like 13,000 views is crazy a lot. So <laughs> that just absolutely blew my mind. Thank you guys for all the love and support you showed on that video. Uh, today, something that I miss in that video, though, is I didn't go see if you could get into the classic Undercity, the undead um, capital, right? That you're not able to access in current retail. Wow, well, there is a version of the Undercity living under Lordaeron Keep, and you can actually access it in the scenario in the Ruins of Lordaeron, and we're going to go take a look, and I'm going to show you how. So... Right over here in the mountains, in the back entrance, as you can see where I'm at, it does recognize you are in the sewers. Now, the way I got back here was these walls are here, but you can just place a pillow like right in the wall here. Once you do that, just sit on the pillow and you should be able to just barely poke out. Now, that one wasn't as good, so we're going to try another one here. But you can just barely clip through the wall here and when you do that your dude should be able to barely see into the sewers and then you can place your infernal strike behind the wall uh and that's exactly how i got in so it's taking me a second i misplaced my pillow here so be careful when you place down your pillow i'm gonna place it in the wall a little more here uh we're gonna try like right there and see how that does I literally just got into the Undercity. <laughs> so there we go. We're a little farther in. There we go. All right, we got in. So that's all I did to get in. You can see all my pillows stacked up. And when we do that, we can just walk straight into the Undercity. So let's go take a look around, guys. I'm excited. As you can tell, it's going to recognize we are inside. Now, I do have limited time here as the, the battle for Lauron scenario is still going. It's been putting me into different scenes in the scenario. So it's been porting me back out of the city. So I do got to kind of make this a little quicker than usual. Uh, but yeah, we're actually going to go into here. And as you guys can tell, we got a whole classic Undercity to go explore to ourselves. Isn't this amazing? Now, we do have that annoying screeching in the background. Unfortunately, I haven't done the full scenario, so you guys may hear some other sounds. <laughs> I do apologize. But uh, we're going to go check out as much as we can of the Undercity and finally be able to explore it the way we want. And we're a Alliance character in the Undercity. How awesome is that? So check this out. We have the full classic Undercity. We have, uh, let's go check out the throne room first before we do anything, but this is awesome. Look at, we can come down here and nothing, you won't die. You can walk around freely, feel free to explore. So if you wanted to ever come back to the undercity, this is definitely a way to go. Oh man, that's creepy. Look at that. Now I never really played an undead. Um, I, I do have undead tunes and I played some few during classic, but I never actually explored the undercity too much. I always thought it was really kind of confusing, the city and the layout. So I just, I don't know, I got more upset than I did happy walking around here. And we're going to go check out the throne room over here where Sylvanas usually sits. And we're going to go take a look and uh, see what we can find in here. Here we are. We're in the throne room. How awesome is this? This is where she normally sits at. Just chilling. How cool is that? We are in the throne room. And we're gonna bring on our toy here. Now we're in charge. <laughs> How awesome is that? Alright, cool. Let's keep moving on. As I like I said, we only got some limited time here, so let's keep going forward. Unfortunately, we can't mount up. Um, because we're technically underground. Uh so normally you could mount up in retail, but because we're underground, now we can't. So that sucks. But we can move around pretty quickly as a demon hunter, so I'm not too worried about that. Let's go take a look and see. Now, they do keep everything. Everything here is intact. Um, everything here is as normal. So, sorry, I keep opening my map and then closing them. But you can see we're going to the rogues quarter right now. You have the magic quarter, the war quarter, 
And I'm not even going to try to pronounce the throne room. But let's see what they keep over here. I'm assuming they keep about everything. There is a gate here. Oh, okay. Can we just walk around it? Has that always been here? Interesting. Why would they block certain places off? Ah, okay. That makes more sense. I see why. I'm assuming you actually go down here in the scenario. But they, they don't allow you to actually go to certain parts of the map. Okay, that makes more sense now. That's my guess. Because it looks like even that part of the map is blocked off. So I bet you they keep you in a certain part over here. But you can't actually get through to go see the rest of the Undercity. Got it. Okay. That's really strange. Man, they really put a lot of protection back here, didn't they? I mean, wouldn't these gates be enough? Like, why do they got to add all this extra crap in there? Fortunately, though, I would like to introduce Blizzard to a demon hunter. So we don't have restrictions. So we should actually be able to still get in there if we just fly. The, my only concern is if we get in there, can we get out? And that's kind of what I'm worried about. So I don't want to get in there and then get stuck. But you guys can see the rogues quarter is there. We just can't get in there because of the gates. So uh, let's go check out the center uh, piece here. I always thought the center part of the Undercity was really cool looking. Alright, let's go up here. This place is like a maze. Currently, if we can get up here, I think it's this way. But you have to take an elevator usually up, don't you? Can we actually do the mailbox? No, okay, I was going to say we can't do our mail here, right? We're Alliance. Check this out. So this is normally where the, uh, I believe the bank was right here in the center. And as you can tell, we got a bunch of war action going on above us. So you can hear the screeching and the people doing the war together. It's so cool to be able to explore an undercity again. Trying to give you guys shots all around here to show you exactly what they keep. Here's the barber. Now, I I wonder if we're ever going to actually come back to the Undercity. I don't know. I was always curious about that. Now, currently, let's see if we can head over to the ma the magic quarter here. Um, there is gates, so we might night might be able to oh maybe we can okay so what's nice about this is even though there's gates we can just walk around here okay yeah we can get in the other sides there's just gates blocking off the other side which i guess makes sense well i guess it doesn't stop us because we're already in the inside can we walk in the goo oh we can we can swim is it hurting us though no it's not okay this is always a really neat city. It had like that um, Nightmare Before Christmas vibe to it. I don't know. That's what I always thought of when I thought of the Undercity. I always think of Nightmare Before Christmas. Like Skill Jack coming out and all that. An Ooga Booga. So I'm assuming... Yeah, you can't actually get over there. Okay. But we can get in the work order. Just go this way. And just go out because you're never supposed to be back here to begin with there we go who needs gates now we can get in here check that out all right now we're in the runes of lord or on section so normally you see here there's gates that keep you in I'm surprised the scenario hasn't stopped us. Here goes the war quarter. What I thought was interesting though is that the game doesn't actually recognize the Undercity as like a place anymore. Have you noticed that? So if you try to type in your chat, like the the Undercity doesn't really is supposed to exist, right? Anymore. So uh, they actually took out like the chat and, and all that too. Like if like your your chat won't change to Undercity chat anymore, 
Which, I don't know, I thought was pretty interesting. Because normally when you do OOB and you go outside the map, what they'll do is they'll recognize that the game, you're still in the game, and that uh, you still have, like, different chats you can go into with your general chat and all that. But in here, it's just completely gone. So... Okay, so they don't actually block off a ton of it in the scenario. So you can go into here, you can go into there. But they do block off the other section, so they're not easy to go to. Huh, alright. Well, that's cool. Well, anyways, guys, I mean, I just wanted to show you this real quick. Nothing too special, but it is fun to see that you can get to another full Undercity in the game. So, you guys ever want to make videos or do stuff in the Undercity again? This is where you can go to. I mean, this is it right here. So we're in the Undercity. You might have to deal with the annoying scenario noises. But other than that, you got a full Undercity to walk around in. So, pretty awesome. Alright guys, well I'm going to end the video here. I hope you have fun exploring the classic Undercity as much as I did. And uh, yeah, go enjoy. And as always, my name is Nathan. I'll catch you on the next video. Take care.